Hello YouTube, what's up? It is Mr. ETA416 there, and there you see my beautiful face. <laughs> um, I am here to show you guys how to do a system restore point on Windows 7 operating system. And I figured I would do a computer video right now because I just recently had some trouble with my computer. And I don't want you guys to go through the same thing. So I am here to help you guys out. And please rate, comment, subscribe, like the video favorite it, do all that other fun stuff. And here we go. Alright, so when you guys get a virus on your computer, I'm going to show you guys how to fix it uh, very easily. And I will go through all the steps here. Um, first, what you want to do about, I'd say roughly, I, I would, if I was you, I would do it once a day. But I don't want to pressure you. So I'd say about two or three times a week. Alright. Um, you want to go on your computer and if you use your computer for um, many reasons um, like pirate hunting and stuff like that um, I would do this alright now what you want to do is you want to come down to the start menu down here the start key which is this thing down here and you want to let me move this up a little bit you want to right click on the computer um, thing right here right click on it and choose properties. All right, all right, and this is just so you guys know. This is how to get a system restore point. All right, now right here it'll say system protection. All right, you want to click on that, and it'll bring it'll bring up this um, little box thingy, majiggy right here. All right, this freaking thing, this thing right here. All right. And it'll have a couple of options, computer name, hard, hardware, advanced, system protection, and remote. Now what we want to do, we want to focus on system protection right here. It'll have a couple of op options. It'll ask you if you want a system restore. And unless you're, um, unless you're doing this with the virus, you can do that. But first you want to make a system restore point. All right, so you want to highlight the um, current th uh, hard drive you're using, or local disk, as I call it, um, which would be the C drive for me, and it'll be the system C drive on a local disk. And you're going to want to create a system restore point. All right, you can call it anything you want. Um, I would call mine Mr. DTA416, but because I've done this about five other times in the past two minutes, um, because I recorded this a couple times now, um, I'm not going to do it. And then you hit create, okay? And I'm not going to hit create because I've done it already a couple times. Alright, and that's, you have to highlight it and then create, alright? Now, um, after you've done that, alright, say you get a virus, alright? The next, I don't know, week you get a virus for some reason because you watched this video and stuff. But you did that just to be sure that you wouldn't get a virus, alright? What you want to do um, is start the computer up in safe mode, and if you don't know how to do that, um, what you do is you hold, uh, when your computer is starting up, you have to continuously hit F8, alright? You have to continuously hit F8, and if you don't know where F8 is, it's above the numbers 7 and 8 on your um, keyboard here um, when you're typing, alright? Um, F8 will probably be there, again, I assume. Um, and you have to continuously click that until you see um, a bunch of options um, and you'll see safe mode and you're going to want to run the computer in safe mode and what that does is it, it it's like a system block or something like that it, it like starts the computer up so there's like nothing that can touch the computer it's like a backup thing for the computer alright and you want to set it up and then you want to go to your let me exit this here you want to go to your control panel when you're in safe mode and there'll be a, uh, like a system security um, thing there and it's going to ask you for um, a restore point alright and I'm going to just do it this way here I'm gonna go to computer here alright and when you do that it'll bring up this little box this thing right here it'll bring this up Alright, after you click on the system restore, you see it right there. And you're going to want to click next. And you see I have already saved it twice. And you want to click on it. Double click. 
scanning for any affected programs or drivers. I don't think I've ever done this. Alright, give it a second. Any time now. That's what I love about computers. They they give you a chance to bond with your inner self. That sounded really friggin' gay. Come on, I only got frickin' two hours, you know. Come on, oh my gosh, there we go. There you go. So now you can close out of it, and there's no thing there. And um, what I remember doing when I was doing this a couple minutes ago, um, when I was trying to get the virus off my computer, is it had this thing right here. It says the date right here that you did it. Um, now your computer normally does it about once a week, maybe, if the computer feels like it, I guess. Um, anyways, um, I restored it from the last restore point, and uh, I got my original computer back. And you see right here, um, the thing this year. Alright guys, and if there's any questions, whoops, oh there we go. Um, see how it, um, it says finish, and then it'll restore the computer from that date. Alright, so if I wanted to restore this one, I click next, ah, excuse me, uh, it's my ear. Um, and then it'll say finish, alright, and then it'll restore your computer, so. That is how to do a system restore, and I, if you guys have any questions on how to restore your computer, um, or how to find safe mode or anything, please uh, give me a comment below. I really appreciate it. Rate, comment, like I said, and subscribe, favorite the video, and stay tuned to my the rest of my zombie rapetage videos. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching.